When you first start my view board for Android, you'll probably see this little window down here on the bottom right that says please activate the software. We're going to go ahead and click activate. You'll get a notification that asks you if you want to do personal or entity. We're going to do personal. And then it's going to ask us to enter a board name, an email address, and then choose our theme. Let's go ahead and fill this out really quickly. Notice that you need to double check your email just to make sure it's same both times. For theme, just leave it on education, unless you teach physical education, which you might want to choose sport. We're going to go ahead and submit. And then you'll get a notification that's saying the software's been registered, but that we need to go check our email to make sure that we get that activation enabled. If you don't do the email, you'll get another warning that says the software hasn't been activated yet and we won't have all the features. So let's go to our email and activate this software. We can see our activation email over here on the right, so we're just going to choose the red activate link, which will then open a new tab in our browser letting us know that our software has successfully been activated. Note that back in my view board, you can always resend the activation email if you need it one more time but we need to restart my view board in order for us to be able to activate it. So using the X in the top right, we're gonna close my view board. We'll start it up again, and now we'll see we don't get the warning. The sign on menu popped up there, which lets us know that the software's been activated. You can also check activation by going to the settings and then choosing the I, and you can see here that uh, I have no notification that says my software has not been activated yet.